Eva here showing you how to install your AOC gaming monitor. So it came with these instructions, which we do not need and we're just going to throw away. Um, and then it came with these two cords. So let me open these and show you what they are. Inside this one is a VGA cord. You don't really need a VGA cord for anything because it's 720. And 720 is trash, so we're going to throw that one away. And then it came with this other cord. And this other cord is a power cord, which we are going to use. Um, so we will go ahead and un, uh, undo that, and then we can either plug this in now or set it off to the side. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and plug it in right now. Um, and this will be plugged into the back of the monitor. Um, and now as you see, the stand is on here. So let me just show you how to get the stand on here. So if you see the bottom of it, um, you take this little thing and you pry up this um, this little lever thing and then it's a screw. So you unscrew it like this. Um, well, you do this backwards to put it on, but I'll show you here. Um, so now that this is off, you tilt it like to take it apart. Um, and this is what it looks like without the bottom stand on it. So to put it on, you um, do that backwards. So you have your monitor and then you put it on. So there's this little lever. And so you have to get the little lever inside that groove in there. Um, so you just do that and you make sure you get it situated nice in there and then you will screw this um, tight. This is screwing the threads into it. Um, and then I will show you how to do the VSO um, mount if you have, if you're going to mount it on the wall or something. And that is right back here. And this is a 72 inch VSO mount. So you'll just buy one online like Amazon or something. Um, but yeah, and so now I'm going to go ahead and plug in my monitor. Um, this is where you plug in your DVI, and you will want to use DVI because um, 1080p. So you just plug that right in the back of there, and then you fire up your computer. Um, and then after you have plugged in, so here, why don't I just go ahead and show you with the VGA cord that it actually um, does work so that you guys know, um, and I can kind of show you what 720p looks like also um, and show you that you guys should use um, DVI. So here's your VGA cord if you do want to use VGA for some reason and you just plug that in there. Um, you don't really need to screw those things in you can if you want. Um, there's not really a reason for it. Um, and then you plug this other one into the back of your uh, PC. So I will just grab this and show you here what I'm doing. So here I am in the back plugging in a VGA. Okay, never mind. There's no, I don't have a VGA. All right, guys. So I grabbed a DVI cord. Um, and now I will undo this little thing so I can go ahead and plug it into my monitor and show you. So here's where we're going to get rid of this dumb VGA cord. And now you plug in the DVI. And click it in just like that. So it's in there. And then you take DVI. And we're going to plug that in. There's different types of DVIs that do different things. Um, the one has like sound, one doesn't have sound, different things like that. Alright, so it's plugged in nice and snug. Um, and now hit the power button. Now it comes on, um, and then this is adjustable also. Um, all right, guys, and here's your 1080. Let me turn this this way. It's your 1080p, nice clear display right there. Um, but and then this also does tilt. So um, as you can see, like the bottom tilts like that, and then um, it goes like backwards or um, forward. Well, I don't want to. Let me be careful here. It's brand new monitor. Don't break it. But then it tilts like flat or even down a little bit. Um, so yeah, I do recommend this monitor. This is the AOC um, gaming monitor. This is a 22 inch um, 1080p. There, it's a pretty good deal on Amazon. All right, thanks for watching.